do you give your child? Hunter volunteer. And what do you have? And then you have asked to have Hunter baptized. In doing so, you are accepting the responsibility of training him in the practice of the faith. In the light, we pray for Hunter Valentino. Set him free from original sin. Make him a temple of your glory and send your Holy Spirit to dwell within him. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. We anoint you with the oil of salvation in the name of Christ our Savior. May he strengthen you with his power who lives and reigns forever and ever. Amen. Amen. Watch, you may help yourself come forward. Okay. <laughs> come on, Hunter. Don't be scared. <laughs> oh, oh, wow. <laughs> okay. Hunter Valentino, I baptize you <laughs> in the name of the Father. <laughs> Goodbye. And of the sun. And of the Holy Spirit. Yay, yeah, you took a bath. Amen. 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 Woohoo, you took a bath. <laughs> got a saint here, Saint Hunter. Saint Hunter, there you go. Saint He's full of God's grace. He's now a child of God. He's our brother in Christ, and now he's even closer to us. And God has given him the gifts of faith, hope, and love. He's part of God's holy church, okay? Very good. Very good, yay, Hunter. And now I'm gonna give uh, Hunter four more blessings. Oh, my blessings. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to anoint Hunter with uh, oil of chrism oil. This oil is blessed by our bishop. It's going to be used on Hunter's confirmation day when the bishop says, Hunter, be sealed with the gift of the Holy Spirit. This is the same oil they use when uh, the bishop ordains a priest and the bishop he pours it over their head, right? At the day of the ordination, they use chrism oil. The same oil as you when they make a new church or a new altar, the bishop would come and uh, bless the altar with this oil. So it's precious oil, okay? In this case, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna anoint Hunter on the crown of his head. God the Father of our Lord Jesus Christ has freed you from sin and given you new birth by water and the Holy Spirit and welcomes you into his holy people. He now anoints you with the chrism of salvation. As Christ was anointed priest, prophet, and king, so may you live always as a member of his holy body, sharing everlasting life. Amen. 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 Now I'm going to bless this white shirt. This is a white garment. Okay. Hunter Valentino, you become a new creation and clothe yourself in Christ. See in this white garment the outward sign of your Christian dignity. 
with your friends to help you by word and example, bring that dignity unstained into the everlasting life of heaven. Amen. Amen. So he's a saint. He's full of God's grace. Keep him unstained from sin, okay? Do the best you can, okay? Okay. So one of Sean. Would you like to light this for Hunter? And hold it for him. Receive the light of Christ. Parents and Godparents, this light is entrusted to you to be kept burning brightly. Hunter has been enlightened by Christ. May he walk always as a child of the light. May he keep the flame of faith alive in his heart. When the Lord comes, may he go out to meet him with all the saints in the heavenly kingdom. Amen. Amen. Remember Jesus said, you are the light of the world. Let your light shine on others. So they could see the good that you do, and then they are glorified God. So we're supposed to be witnesses to Christ. We are the light of the world. Now, Jesus did many miracles in healing people. And there's this man who was deaf and mute. And he blessed this man. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to bless Hunter's ears in his mouth. The Lord Jesus made the deaf hear and the dumb speak. He soon touched your ears to receive his word in your mouth to proclaim his faith to the praise and glory of God the Father. Amen. 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 You have put on Christ in him you've been baptized. Alleluia, alleluia. <laughs> Dearly beloved, Hunter Valentino has been reborn in baptism. He is now called the child of God, for so indeed he is. In Holy Communion, he sh will share the banquet of Christ's sacrifice, calling God his Father. In confirmation, you receive the fullness of God's Spirit. In the name of this child, in the spirit of our common sonship, let us pray together the words our Lord has given us, the Our Father. So together, our Father. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy, thy kingdom, kingdom come, come. Thy, thy will be done, on earth as, as it is in heaven. heaven. Give, Give us this day our daily bread. And, and forgive, forgive us our, our trespasses, trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, temptation, but deliver us from evil. So now I'm going to bless the mother and father of uh, Hunter, and then I'm going to give you all a final blessing. God the Father, through His Son, the Virgin Mary's child, has brought joy to all Christian mothers, as they see the hope of eternal life shine on their children. May he bless Eunice, the mother of Hunter. She now thanks God for the gift of her child. May she be one with him in thanking him forever in heaven. In Christ Jesus our Lord. Amen. Amen. God is a giver of all life, human and divine. May he bless the Father of the Lord. He and his wife will be the first teachers of Hunter in the ways of the faith. May they also be the best of teachers, bearing witness to the faith of what they say and do in Christ Jesus our Lord. Amen. Amen. And may you all please stand for the final prayer.